Good morning besties and welcome to a hopefully productive day in the life vlog. The main things on our agenda today, so first I have an eyebrow waxing appointment in about, well it's in le over an hour, but I need to be, I want to be ready to leave in about 45 minutes. So I have that. Then I have, I'm going to a Galentine's Day little get together thing tomorrow night and we're all making different charcuterie boards. I was originally going to make a, sh a fruit charcuterie board, but I'm just not feeling that anymore and since everyone's already making a different type of charcuterie board I'm going I decide I'm changing I'm going the traditional route I'm doing a traditional charcuterie board so now we'll have a little bit of everything so I already placed a Walmart pickup order for those items so I'll be picking those up and then I also need to stop in my apartment and prepare some stuff for um, this weekend we have our winter rendezvous for WASA our Washington State Snowmobile Association and I am in charge of the photo contest, so I just need to get some stuff in order for that. Obviously, as the day goes on, I'll go into more detail, but that's just like an overview. And then a couple other random things that I want to do, I don't know, but we'll go over that. So, anyways, I'm going to go get ready, and yeah, I'll see you when I'm ready. I did my hair, and I did my makeup, and now I'm going to get dressed. Sadly, I got a text from my new lash girl, well... I don't know if she'll be new forever, like, new to me. Um, the person I normally go to doesn't have any appointments for a while, and so I needed to kind of try to find someone else, so I'm branching out. Anyway, she texted me and said that she woke up feeling pretty sick and asked if I could come at the same time tomorrow instead. Luckily, I can, so I'm not getting my eyebrows done anymore today, but we're still going to do everything else and get out of here at a good time. So I'm gonna go let the doggies out that I'm animal sitting, let them go potty, then I'm gonna get dressed, and then we'll get going. Fit check, Grand Canyon, need it. <laughs> Grand Canyon University crew deck from Karina, black leggings from Old Navy. I'm gonna put my flower crocs on. I'll just, let me, let me get them so you can see. Flower crocs. Can you see that? It's like dark. Flower crocs. And then, that's all. Daisy's already back inside. Can you see her? Here she is. I don't know if you can see her. Griffey's still outside. He's always, he always takes a while, so. We're gonna get him in a second, and then we'll head out. I'll head out. They're gonna stay here. <laughs> Even though I'm not getting my eyebrows done right now anymore because she is sick, I'm leaving at the time I would've needed to leave, which is good, because I wanted to leave at the same time, and it's not just like, be like, oh, I don't have to be there at a certain time, like, I can leave whenever. No. No. So, we're leaving right now. And I'm gonna stop at this coffee shop that's like right nearby where the person lives that I'm animal sitting for. And I got a punch card from them yesterday, so I'm like, better go there and use the punch, fill it up. So we're gonna go there, get a drink, and then we will head to my apartment and take care of stuff that needs to be taken care of there. Long story short. I'm gonna try my best. So basically, I went to the coffee shop and I got a lotus and it is so bad. Like it just does not taste good. It tastes not good. I tried like one of their Valentine's Day drinks and it was just, it's just not good. And I was like, this is sucks. So I went to Sundance instead and I got a drink there. It doesn't taste very good either. There's like no ice. I don't, I'm like, what is going on today? Like neither of them taste very good. And I'm really sad about that. But luckily I did get my chicken pesto sandwich. So that's good. Because I wasn't going to get that. Because I didn't go to Sunday. So anyways. So I'm at my apartment. Because I have stuff I need to do here. But also I'm supposed to have a package delivered. And let me give you the details. So long story short. Again. I have been like. I have, I have enough followers on TikTok to be part of their like um I don't know what is it called like the creator marketplace or whatever where I can like link products and like request free samples so I've requested a couple free samples and I've some of them been, have been denied but others have been accepted and one of the ones that was accepted was this like travel bag and I'm really excited for it because I have so many like different times that I can use it so I'm really excited and I got an email this morning saying that it was delivered already and I was like, dang, like it just, I, like when was it even sent out? Like that was so quick. And I'm like, okay, cool. Like super exciting. 
So I need to go to the dollar store, but I was like, let me swing by my apartment first and grab the package to make sure it doesn't get stolen. I get here and it's not here. And I'm like, okay, that's weird. That's really weird. I've never had a package stolen. My neighbors has one time, but since then, nothing's ever happened. And we get a lot of packages. And some of my packages have sat for like at least a day. Never been stolen. Like it's been like three hours, okay? So I'm like, what the heck? So I go on to the email where it says it was delivered to see if I can get any more information. And I go on and I'm looking and it, I go get in there and it says delivered front door slash porch at 11.24 a.m. When I saw that email, it was 11.21 a.m. So... It hadn't... It was saying that it was delivered in the future. So now I'm like, okay, has it really been delivered and been stolen? Or has it not been delivered yet? Because it's telling me it was delivered at 11.24 a.m. Which was... When I opened the email, was three minutes in the future. It is just now 11.24 a.m. And, like... I've definitely had times where, like, someone's like, oh, it's been delivered, but it hasn't actually been delivered yet. So, I'm like, maybe they just, like, marked it as delivered. Like, I don't know what it's being shipped through, but it hasn't really been delivered yet. But, like, here I am. Has it been delivered and stolen, or has it not been delivered yet? I don't know. And I'm really sad because, like, I want it. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. And, like, my neighbor... My neighbor will grab packages for me and vice versa and she'll put them in her house. But normally she tells me if she's going to do that. So I can't imagine she did it and didn't say anything. Because I feel like, cause like she just doesn't do that. So now I'm like really sad and I don't know what to do. I'm like, do I contact them and be like, I didn't get it? Or do I like hope it's still coming? Because why was it saying that it was delivered in the future? That doesn't make any sense. And it also, my package was out for delivery at 8, 12 a.m. So, like, it makes sense that it wasn't delivered. Like, I got the email, like, that at the time that it was out for delivery. Like, it's being distributed from the sorting center, which I'm pretty sure is, like, not in, is, like, in Yakima. I think. I don't know. But I just want it. And I don't want it to be stolen. I think I'm just going to go to the dollar store. Get what I need to get come back and hope it's here after like rechecking the email that i was sent this morning i thought it was sent around the time that they said it was out for delivery they sent me an email around 3 a.m or 2 30 a.m saying that it was delivered it clearly wasn't delivered at that time so i'm hoping that the timing of things is just off and that when i get back oh god looks familiar when i get back to my apartment it will be there and then i'm also going to a snowmobile meeting tonight that's in the same town as my apartment so i will be back here so i could check again tonight but like where is my package and this is not the first like sample i've had sent to me from tiktok and it got delivered just fine so i'm like okay so i know it can work i know it can and so i'm talking to someone on a chat right now but i'm afraid to like close out of the chat and then, like, you know, but they're kind of taking a long time. Um, but I told them what happened, and then they asked for a screenshot to, like, prove that it was, like, the, what I'm saying about it being delivered. So I sent that. <sighs> Anyways, I need to go into the dollar store, and I need to, like, do the stuff that I need to do because I have to be back at Walmart between noon and 1 for my order. So I kind of need to speed things up a little bit. So I'm going to go inside to the dollar store, get the stuff I need for the photo contest that I'm in charge of so we're gonna do that we are out of the dollar store i will show you a haul of what i got for the photo contest after i get back to my apartment because we're kind of on crunch time now wasn't really wanting that but it is okay i have i was on chat i was like in the chat with the tiktok people the whole time they were not very helpful because after all the screenshots and stuff that they asked me for they basically just said that i need to contact the seller I'm sorry, you couldn't have told me that from the start. 
You couldn't have told me from the beginning that you weren't gonna help me and that I needed to contact the seller. We're almost in my apartment, so fingers crossed that I, when I drive by right now to turn into the parking lot that it's on my porch. Fingers crossed, what do you think? Do you think it's gonna be there? I think, I think it is gonna be there. I don't even wanna look. It's not there. What the heck? I'm so mad. Like why? Because I thought it was stolen. But it wasn't delivered until 1124. It wasn't delivered at 1124. So what the heck? Sorry that this vlog is um. I'm not trying to be so negative. But like it's frustrating. You know? It's frustrating. A tree haul. So I got five of these boards. That I'm going to use to make the like board. There are five categories. So I have five boards. So there's plenty of space. I got these letters to make like a better like title on the board so it comes with some gold and green and Wasis colors like green so I think that's perfect. Then I got some more dot labels which turns out we didn't really need these but we have them. <laughs> and then I got these foam mounting dots. I thought these might be easier to hang up the pictures with but there was only one pack so whatever if I need more I have regular like painter tape. Then I got some more mailing tape, which turns out I already have plenty of this too. So we're gonna put all this stuff inside with the other stuff, except for, I'm gonna keep the letters, actually, and the full mounting dots, and one of the boards to put the title on. Cause I think I'm just gonna do one board with the title. Uh, I don't know, actually. Maybe I'll keep all the boards, but this stuff can go inside. Ignore the mess in here, but this is the other stuff we have. Also, I am going to be vlogging this weekend, so you'll get to see more of it. But these are the photo contest entry forms. These are these are all things that I've made. Um, whoops, they're sliding out. These are like some signs, and then signs for the uh, different categories are in there. These are some supplies. We've got tape, we've got pens. Uh, thumbtacks, other little things if people want to write captions. We've got it all in there. The ballots, and they just finished printing. So I printed way more than we need because sadly not as many people come as they used to. But I'm going to bring these with us. Actually, I'm probably not going to bring these, but these will be cut out at some point for people to use to vote. I just checked in for Walmart like saying that I'm on my way so we need to be on our way I'm gonna be there before one thank goodness I was a little nervous I was a little nervous because I was kind of taking a long time at the dollar store because I was like trying to do the conversation with the TikTok thing anyways it is still frustrating because I want the bag I was really excited to get to use it for this weekend so that I could really like talk about it in a video and be like look at what I used it for so it's gonna suck if it if I was like all excited for that and then now it's not actually gonna be there um but it should be I'm really thinking that it was just like marked as delivered oh my gosh even though it wasn't delivered so cross your fingers that that is the case mm. we've done what we can do and Let's go get our stuff for our charcuterie board. We made it to Walmart. I just like checked in. Hopefully they will be bringing out the items soon. I'm really excited to make the charcuterie board though I am nervous because I've never made one before. So I don't really know how it's gonna go. But I think it'll be good. I think it'll be good. Um, so I have that, and then I don't have, the only other thing I have to do tonight is I have my other snowmobile meeting tonight. Oh, they're coming to me right now. Okay, BRB, I don't want to scare them with the camera. He was so nice, that was so nice. Okay, got the goods, I'll do a haul when we get back to the doggies. For the doggies, I just let them out to go potty. So now we are going to do a haul of everything I got for my charcuterie board. Starting with the most exciting thing, you're probably wondering what I'm putting the charcuterie board on. I got a char I got a board. It has like these rigid like dips around the outside to put stuff in, and then it comes with these two little containers, and then this slides out, and it comes with like a couple little like utensils to use. So I'm really excited. Got some crackers. These are just like this 
rectangular crackers, buttery smooth textured crackers, great value brand, of course. <laughs> then I got these everything pita crackers, great value, yummy, yummy. And I got some mixed nuts, green grapes, because those are the best kind. Olives, I've never had, oh, they're stuffed, what? Stuffed with olives with minced pimento. Literally no idea, but I always see green olives on board, so I didn't really know, so I'm just changing it up a little bit. We got these, like, I love these. I've had these for some really turkey sausage sticks. Just chop them up and use that, okay? Cubed ham, salami, some dried uh, apricots, blackberry preservatives, jam, hummus, which probably be eating a lot of that myself while I'm putting this together. Wee brie, is that wee? Little, like... Tri uh, yeah, triangles of brie. Pickles to go in like little containers, but I just want the little mini pickles out of them. So mini uh, dill pickles, different types of sliced cheese. We've got mild cheddar, Colby Monterey Jack, Monterey Jack with jalapeno peppers, and Swiss cheese. So that's what we've got. I'm gonna put this in the fridge for now because I need to do a couple things before we get started. The charcuterie board is done. I, <clears throat> this is the first time I've ever in my whole life made a charcuterie board. And I think this looks really good. So let me know what you think. For my first time, like I think it looks really nice. I'm really scared to saran wrap it now, but it has to be done. So I'm gonna do that and pray. I'm gonna pray then do it. So pray for me, please. <laughs> I'm not probably gonna record that part because I don't know if I wanna be able to watch it back. So. I'll show you once it's saran wrapped. I forgot to show you that it's it saran wrapped, but it's saran wrapped and in the fridge. Thank goodness. And it wasn't too hard. It's only 2.30, so I'm doing really well on time. I am going to... Look how cool these letters are. I had no idea. So I'm going to get out all the letters I need to spell out what I need to spell. And then I'm going to start putting it on the poster board and kind of figure out if I want to put it on one across the top of all of them. Just kind of like figure that out, what it's going to look like. So... We're gonna start by sorting the letters to get the letters I need. So what I'm going to do now is I'm gonna put it on three poster boards and then I have two different like ideas slash variations for how I'm going to set it up, but I'm not gonna connect the poster boards yet. Probably won't do that till I'm actually at the place. 
yeah. So I can put it on three poster boards and those three poster boards can either be in the middle, they can be like spread out because I'm just gonna do it on three of them and then I can figure it out later. So I'm gonna put Wasa on one, photo on one, and contest on the other. And I'm going to use these foam mounting dots to put it. I don't really have anywhere I can easily put you. Maybe I can. Maybe you'll get to see. literally not really done anything productive or really done much at all <laughs> since I last updated the vlog I was gonna read sat down with the book and everything didn't do it um, but I've just been hanging out with the doggies and I watched my friend Emily's live for a bit and that was really fun but now I'm just waiting for my little friend Griffy out there he's on his way over actually surprisingly usually I have to go get him waiting for him to come inside he goes potty and then he like goes and like stands in the corner of the fence and like watches for I don't know what um, but I'm about to go to my second snowmobile meeting for tonight like we had one last night I guess you didn't know that because I wasn't vlogging yesterday had one last night have the other one tonight and I'm about to head there and then stop at my apartment and hope that the package is there cross your fingers for me but anyways we're gonna get going very shortly. I am back with the dogs. They just went outside. Our snowmobile meeting went pretty well. Um, I, well, my dad and I, I sell the raffle tickets. Um, we do like a 50-50 drawing at our meetings. Anyways, my dad and I won tonight, the 50-50, and we won the bigger prize. So we won 14 50 and split it. So big winners tonight. Um, there's a little bit of, you know, there's always a few things that happen at like certain, well, usually at this snowmobile meeting that kind of irked me, but you know, so be it. And then I got my first Shamrock Shake of the season, so that's very exciting. And then, oh, I checked again for my ma my package. Before the meeting and after the meeting, nothing. So I contacted the seller on TikTok and they have, no, they're like, they're all confused. They're like, we don't have any record of us sending you anything. Oh, then why do I? Why do I have record of it? But why don't I have the actual item? So I have no idea what's gonna happen with that. And I'm really sad because I was so excited about the bag and now I feel like I'm kind of getting snubbed. So we'll see what happens, but at least I didn't pay for it because then I'd be really angry. And like way more like, okay, but what are we gonna do about this? Like, I paid for this. So, you know, we'll see, maybe it'll show up tomorrow. Hopefully, I don't know. I really am just frustrated. Um, but yeah, so anyways, I think I'm gonna make a TikTok for a different item for TikTok shop. I think I'm gonna try to do that tonight. Um, but yeah, we'll see. And then I need to shower at some point. I really don't want to be, oh, I might shower in the morning. I don't really know what I'm going to do, but I don't want to be up super late, basically. So, yeah. I just started the dishwasher. It is much, much later. I'm getting ready to go to bed. I'm going to take the dogs out and brush my teeth and all that good stuff. But I did make a TikTok earlier about my new journal. So that was really good. And yeah, but that's pretty much everything. Thank you for coming along with me in my productive day in the life. I got... I got the, um, the majority of things done that I needed to get done today. I will be doing more stuff tomorrow, but tomorrow's gonna be much more like, gotta get stuff in order kind of day. So vlogging would be a little bit more stressful. So I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. 
and feel free to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. And I would love for you to stick around. So yeah, I think that's everything. Thank you guys again so much for watching and being here to hold me accountable and being productive today. And I will see you guys next time. Bye from, where's she going? Bye from me, Daisy and Griffey. Bye.